Donald Trump went off about late-night hosts during a September 23rd rally in Pennsylvania for his presidential campaign and claimed Johnny Carson, who died in 2005, needed to be back on the small screen. He's not very funny, Trump said, referring to Jimmy Fallon after a clip from Kamala Harris' 2020 appearance on The Tonight Show aired during the rally, which focused on fracking. Malala Kamala just don't give a frack. Those three guys are being blown away by Fox News, Gutfeld, Trump added. When I first ran in 2015 or was thinking about running I went on, Jimmy's, show with The Night Show, which is dying. They're all dying. Where is Johnny Carson? Bring back Johnny. They made you appreciate the greatness of Johnny Carson. These three guys are so bad. Of course, people couldn't get over the remarks, especially since Carson hasn't been alive in quite some time. One person wrote, I got you Johnny Carson has been dead for nearly 30 if you want to be technical 29 years and 8 months, while another said, he passed away two decades ago. A third person stated, shouldn't Miguel be worried about their cult leader at this point? He's clearly showing mental health issues, while a fourth person said, his marbles are gone, whatever brain matter he had is mush. This is hardly the first time Trump has brought up something where he seems out of touch. As OK previously reported, he has continued to bring up Hannibal Lecter, a fictional character from the Silence of the Lambs movie. They're emptying out their mental institutions into the United States, our beautiful country, Trump said in May. And now the prison populations all over the world are down. They don't want to report that the mental institution population is down because they're taking people from insane asylums and from mental institutions. You know what the difference is, right? An insane asylum is a mental institution on steroids. Silence of the Lambs Has anyone ever seen The Silence of the Lambs? The late, great Hannibal Lecter is a wonderful man. He oftentimes would have a friend for dinner. Remember the last scene? Excuse me. I'm about to have a friend for dinner, as this poor doctor walked by. I'm about to have a friend for dinner. But Hannibal Lecter. Congratulations. The late, great Hannibal Lecter, he continued. Needless to say, people were very confused how the movie and the rally were connected. One person wrote, imagine if Joe Biden said Hannibal Lecter is a wonderful man. The media continues to normalize Donald Trump, who is insane, while another person pointed out how multiple gaffes, stating, at a New Jersey rally, Donald Trump made repeated reference to the late, great Hannibal Lecter and confused Jimmy Carter with Jimmy Connors, forcing a difficult conversation about Biden's age and mental acuity.